All right, let's get started here. I'm going to play the song back to back. This is a song called Permanence from my band Outrun the Sunlight. It's probably the heaviest and most difficult song that we have. Permanence. bridge because it's like punchier sound especially on this bass compare is the slap. This one sounds like fuller, even though the settings on the uh, jazz bass, the carbon, are like a little like more rolled off on the high ends.
listen back to this and see what I think, but obviously this one is set up to be much brighter. So if I roll off all the trouble, I noticed that this bass is sort of always bright. I'm also noticing this one's easier to play and perhaps more articulate than the jazz bass, which was rolled off to be more on to the bridge pickup. So there was less of the neck pickup in there. It's probably like a 20% cut on the neck. Tone cut way down. I think the treble, um, there's a two band EQ on there and I think the treble was rolled pretty much all the way off. Um, so interesting. I'm, I'm so torn because they're both so different, but I think somehow they both work, even though the jazz bass style one has more of like a vintagey warmth vibe to it. And this one's like very modern, especially with like the treble at neutral here. It's like very bright. Let me get the other bass. And I feel like on this one, even though I have it set up um, to be very not bright, and that more like warm vintage sound, which I think is a lot to do with the tone knob on this cut pretty, pretty low, like 80%. Even this non-aggressive tone definitely cuts, especially when you when it hits a compressor. I notice it really cuts through if you have a little bit more of an aggressive compressor set. And then playing towards the bridge. Surprisingly, that cuts in a way that you would expect as a bass player. But I can get the neck pickup, or like if I put my if I hit the strings more towards the neck pickup, I can still get like a a nice aggressive tone there too. So they both work. My concern was actually just getting it to cut through the mix, which is why I picked that super heavy song. Um, but I think they both work. And I'm going to listen back and just hear like which one I think works better. Uh, if you have any questions about either bass, let me know. I'm doing this pretty much for myself here, just to listen back. So I will throw it up on the uh, the old YouTubes there because I, I get a lot of value from watching other people's videos. So I hope you do too. I'll right, see you guys later.